I would like to take a quick glance with you on the new Dupit Support Center and let's just open it up like so and I directly stick it into my layout so as you can see we have a new dialog here for the Dupit Support Center we see some buttons on the left side here and we also see uh, a sub tab called help system and you find the Dupit documentation in there and you can now browse the documentation for Dipit products directly inside of Cinema 4D and as you may see we have well uh, loosely followed uh, the structural um, appearance of the Cinema 4D help so we keep the general Cinema 4D workflow for the user um, well and whenever you have a problem or you just don't know what a function does you can simply check it out in the documentation pretty quickly now and although this is very helpful uh, this may be a little slow when you uh, would like to have information about a certain uh, setting so um, while working you could simply um, select the according element in the attributes manager then drag and drop it here in the search field of the Pit Support Center and it will take you directly to the description of uh, the according function in the documentation. So this is a context sensitive uh, search function for all elements that appear in any of the Dipit products either in an object, a tag, or in a shader, a video post, effect, etc. So this makes working with Dipit even more comfortable and well sometimes you may encounter a bug in a Dipit product for example it crashes your Cinema 4D whenever you change a certain uh, setting here in, in the Attributes Manager then you can click on the Send a Bug Report and uh, you get a new dialog called Katachi Bug Reporter and we have a button and a checkbox here. The checkbox says that you can include the latest Cinema 4D bug report that has been generated on the last crash. And if you're uncomfortable with that, simply untick it. But it is very helpful. And of course, you can also select a file to send to us. Uh, the best thing would be if it was the file that crashed or that triggers that triggered that crash. Um, well, and you can give a bug description. I have change the color channel and bada boom all right so it's a complete bug report and you can send it out and that's it so you have sent a bug report via email to us uh, without much hassling all right the next thing you could do you could check for online updates or you can visit the community forums directly inside of Cinema 4D, check out new threads and news or uh, tutorials, whatever you want to post an image into the gallery. And uh, if you're a demo user or if you simply want to upgrade your Dipit product, you can click on the purchase Dipit and it takes you directly to the online shop of Dipit Effects and Dipit Plants. And you can, well, buy an update or a new license, whatever you uh, require. So the Dipit Support Center is a great uh, service point in Dipit Effects and Dipit Plants.